raging above us is no cause for alarm. The laser striking the moon's surface is merely speculating for deposits. For your own safety, Concordia will remain locked down for the next several weeks. That is all. I wonder what Pandora tastes like. Screw this. Let's go pay him a visit. Like I said, don't get trigger happy. If he's got info, I don't want to hear him gurgle it through blood. He has horrible diction to start with. The Marif's elevator is sealed, remember? That's just great. I do have a recording of the Marif talking sexy to Serena, the custom bot's favorite squeeze. Nah, that wouldn't work. Could we use that recording of the Marif talking to the Geisha bot? Maybe blackmail our way in? Yahtzee! Let's go find ourselves one soon-to-be outraged customs claptrap. Get that recording ready, Mox. That thing's gonna destroy the moon! Come back here! I am the law! The law doesn't make mistakes! Hey! Lawbot! You've just interrupted an officer carrying out his duty! Uh, we're here to file a complaint. Your awesome Marif's been breaking the law. We have evidence. Breaking the law? Why don't you tell me all about it? Thank you for your concern, citizen. Rest assured it shall be long. Long live the Marif. Mox, hit it. Oh, blimey, you really know how to listen to a bloke's problems. I'll give you that. You sure I can't book you for more, uh, uh physical services? I'm a bloody stress volcano right now, and I can do with the, uh, with the, uh, relief. You know that's not what Geisha bots are programmed for. Serena, really? I'm your Merith. You'd be doing Concordia Republic service. I'd make it worth your while. I'm swimming in dial money right now. <laughs> the Merith's interfacing with my Serena? No! I feel so betrayed! And according to my records, the Merith doesn't have the appropriate paperwork to engage in such activities, which kind of makes my outrage morally justifiable. Awesome! Hey, I'm with you, pal. Word is, he's got another appointment booked with Serena right now. What? Citizens, that was not. That may have sounded like my voice, but I, 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 I've been impersonated by someone who sounds like me. I, I, I appreciate you allowing me privacy at this difficult time. Thank you. This man has no shred of honor. This guy's so busted. Without an inter-organic fraternization license, I'm gonna make his life a living hell! Come on, elevator, let's go! Serena, I'm coming, my love! This is more like it. And here we go! To the mouth! Seriously? You idiot machine? The offices are off! <laughs> right! I'm such a kidder! Up we go!
However, as I was already going to do that... We can talk this out, Jackie. I don't really work for Zarplin. Hunter Team Meredith, you are hereby under arrest for violating Elpis Ethical Code 3110, forbidding unlicensed interplay between... Oh my God! You stole my girlfriend, you need back! Open this door! Oh, Serena! Talk about your win-win, that's awesome. Let's move it! Jackie! Ha <laughs> you should have said you were dead. You should have said so! I traced the signal that took down our systems on Helios. And guess what? It came from here. Your office. Signal? Signal. She might be doing. Where did she come from? And please, lie to me. I really want you to lie to me. I don't know. What are you gonna do with me? <laughs> Nothing. I was just messing with you. Get the hell out of here. I've been thinking there's a way back to Helios. I surrender. Awesome master plan. Taking the fight to Helios is gonna need an army, so we make one. Head down to Springs, I'll explain on the way. I'm gonna stay here, gonna go through that Marif stuff. We're making a freaking robot army, baby! <laughs> Hell yeah! Shopping list simple. Some serious combat chassis and top-of-the-line military AI to run them. Word is, Springs is a lady for the AI. Hey Mox, you know where I can build me some kick-ass robot bodies? Since that giant laser is gonna kill, well, everyone, I know who might be willing to scout around for hardware. Let me talk to them and get back to you. Sounds good. Let's hustle, people. We got a moon to save. What did you think of Jack when you first met him, Bill? Considering he was the guy Moxie left you for, I didn't like him. You don't like anybody. I like Brick. Booyah! That laser just keeps on coming. Little Miss Moxie sits on her boxy, consuming her whiskey and cake. Along comes Ms. Springs with other fine things, for that's how a courtship you make. How you going? I finally got all my stuff back here. Welcome to my store, Springs Emporium O Stuff. There was an F, but that fell off. 